fuel system. The fuel supply from the aircraft is delivered to the fuel control unit inlet. It is filtered by a fuel filter installed on the fuel control unit housing. The filter condition is monitored by a clog indicator. The fuel flows internally through the high pressure pump to the fuel pressure regulator and the servo valve. The pressure pump is protected by a pressure relief valve. The fuel pressure regulator supplies servo fuel to operate the inlet guide vane actuator and the bleed control valve. The fuel control unit servo valve regulates the fuel flow to the power section. The fuel flow is controlled by the three-way solenoid valve. The servo valve and the three-way solenoid valve are controlled by the electronic control box. When the three-way solenoid valve is opened, the metered fuel is supplied to the fuel flow divider located at the 9 o'clock position on the turbine case. The flow divider distributes the fuel to the two fuel manifolds. During the initial start sequence, fuel is supplied to the three pilot injectors through the pilot injector manifold. When the fuel pressure increases to a specific value, fuel is supplied to the six main fuel injectors through the main injector manifold. When the APU is running, all of the fuel injectors are supplied with fuel. When the APU is stopped, the residual fuel from the fuel manifold is purged through the APU exhaust. The combustion chamber is drained through the combustion chamber drain valve installed at the 6 o'clock position on the combustion case. The drain valve is connected to the drain system manifold which drains fluids from the air bypass plenum and the actuator and pump seal drain areas to the drain mast located at the 3 o'clock position on the right side of the APU.